What do I have next for you guys? I have a box from Unique Commodities. And that's my bill. Taronda over at Unique Commodities. This is a card that she included for me. It was my birthday, and so she sent me a card. And look how sparkly it is. It's sparkly like all the bath bombs. Thank you, friend. Um, and got the invoice with the pricing. Yay. So let's see what's in the box. I will tell you, as soon as I cut it open, it smelled so good. I love that. Oh, oh. She gave me an ornament. Saw that she actually does this type of stuff on her side as well. So check her out. Um, she makes little ornaments and plaques and things of that nature on her side as well. So this is a handmade ornament. Thank you. I will put this on my tree lovingly. Thank you. All right. First up, what do we have here? Oh, yes, yes. I bought some earrings for my daughter-in-law. And uh, yes, Taronda also does these. And so I went on her site and handmade jewelry is always the best. And I bought these earrings for my daughter-in-law. Looks like there's some lint on it of some sort. But look how pretty they are. So, some earrings for my daughter-in-law. Supporting the, the uh, small businesses. And it came in a really pretty box. So I'm just going to throw it in a, one of the bags that I have for her downstairs. And the next. Oh, yes. This is her limoncello. Lemoncello. I don't know how she pronounces it. Oh, she, she packed this really well. Where's my scissors? I don't know. I don't know where my scissors are. Oh. I love this bath bomb. Um, she puts on here that she gave me a limoncello, limoncello because I already know. I love this bath bomb. I've already had it. And um, she sent it to me as a birthday gift. It smells like an actual lemon, meaning it's none of that candy stuff. It just smells so good. It smells amazing. And um, I can't wait to look at it again. It's super shimmery. I like lemon and grape. Lemon and grape. Just so you guys know, that's what it was. That was the video that I made that had everybody starting to make great bath bombs as I like lemon and grape are missing from the bath bomb world that's that video I put out there all right what's up next she packages these very well and I don't know what I did with my scissors because I'm up here working and unboxing at the same time oh yes this beautiful thing Mmm, smells really good. This is um, Shine Bright Bath Bomb, and it was $6.95, and it's scented in pineapple jasmine. It's pretty and sparkly, and I can't wait to see the bath bomb uh, foam just come up through the center of that. It's going to be super nice. Oh, that's a really good bargain, actually. So I've seen people sell it for a lot more than this. Very pretty, very super pretty. Let me pull back just in case I'm not capturing it all. Next, we have Blue Snowflake Kisses Bath Bomb. This was another part of her birthday gift to me, so I don't know the cost, but it's super shimmery. It's in Cherry and Spearmint. I don't like mint, but I do, I don't mind spearmint. I don't like that peppermint stuff. And then I, um, what is this? This girl is going off. Sending me birthday goodies. 
She sent me this forever thankful and pineapple jasmine as a gift. See the shimmers, Rhonda? You see that gold shimmering with the flash? She and I were having a discussion about flash versus non-flash and why the gold shimmers. Why I prefer the flash versus the dull flash. I like to see the sparkle with the flash, with the bright flash, which is why I use bright flash when I do my demos and my um, unboxings, because I like you guys to see. And then she sent me this um, Oopsie bath bomb um, of Luscious Lips. So it was damaged, but she knows that I had said that my son would probably um, like the scent of it. And so it's uh, broken. So she sent it to me for scent purposes and so that my son could use it in his bath. Just because it's broken doesn't mean it doesn't do a good job in the tub. Doesn't mean it doesn't smell good. Doesn't mean it doesn't sparkle. So I will be giving this to my son. What do we have? Girl, what is going on here? What is this? Oh, yes, yes. This I ordered, right? Yeah, this I ordered, yeah. Um, the little hat. Sparkly, sparkly. This is called, what is it called? Winter hat. That's what it's called. <laughs> Winter hat. So cute. Sparkly. This, what is that? Um, and it's sort of like uh, ombre colored, which I liked. And that one was four seventy five. And I think this is the one that we really started talking about, where I said I wanted it to shine and shimmer in the flash. And this is the Pink Crush Bath Bomb. And it was $5. And it, I got, it's this cherry scented. I got the cherry scented one. I don't know if there's more than one scent, but this comes in cherry scent. Look, look at that. Look at what the beauteousness does with the flash, you see? Shing, shing, shimmer, shimmer. Beautiful. Do I have, is that it? Oh, one more. Pretty sure that's it, because, yeah, that's it. Um, pot of gold. This was an oopsie pot of gold that she sent me. Because, again, just because it's damaged doesn't mean it doesn't work well. And it's a little crummy or crumbly. And so it's full of shimmer. And it will be used. It will be put to good use. So that's what we have from um, Unique Commodities. We have her pot of gold. No clue how much it is. We have this pink crush. It was $5. We have this um, Luscious Lips, which is scented in Delicious Man. It's not what it's scented in. It's scented in a perfect man, actually. Um, and it's an oopsie. We have this Forever Thankful. And that was a freebie for my birthday. This one was $4.75. And it was a winter hat. We had the Blue Snow Kisses. No clue how much it is. We had these beautiful earrings. These earrings were 16 I don't think I mentioned it before. These were $16.95. I'm sorry, $16.99. Oh, I'm sorry, $16.95. I was right the first time. Um, we had a very sweet and kind, cute Christmas ornament handmade by her. We had the limoncello. It's heavy, actually. It's a, quite a massive bath bomb. And then finally, we had this um, Shine Bright bath bomb, which I really like the shape of, and I can't wait to see because of the way this is shaped in here. Can't wait to see the foam come through it. So that's it for Unique Commodities. I will be back with another unboxing. These unboxings are exhausting, but I want
want to show you guys as much product as I can. Because that's what I do. Alright guys, I'll be back. <laughs>